It's our fifth day in France. We're finally getting a gluten-free crepe. Let's go. Nutella, of course. Oh, that's a big bite. That's a big Go bite. For it. <laughs> so good. Is it good? Does it taste like Nutella? Tastes like Nutella. Also got an omelet and salad because your girl needs some protein. <laughs> talking about the boat. First gelato of the trip. The we, first gelato. We couldn't wait till Italy. <laughs> what flavors did you get, babe? Uh, amar amarinella? Uh... <laughs> no, amaretto is almond. Amarina is cherry. Amarina is always my favorite. Cherry is always fire. Fire. Nutella, oh. and then salted caramel. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the Nutella is not my favorite. Nutella? What? How did Nutella let us down? The Amarena's decent. This is not real gelato. No, we need to go to Italy. We need to go to Italy. Good morning. Well, Molly this morning is not feeling super well. She woke up feeling a little bit down. I think we probably haven't slept enough. So this morning uh, I'm doing a little bit of a celebrity step in for Molly. And uh, I'm running to the bakery across town to find some gluten free food. The spot I'm trying to go find. So we'll see. Hopefully I have some luck. And of course, you know, when I'm sick, all I do is just stay in bed and not do anything. And Molly is currently working on the podcast. So that just tells you what a stud she is. So my French isn't very good, but to me that says Mason Mart. So yeah, I think that had my name written all over it. So this 
is the only thing that this bakery has that's gluten free is these macaroons. Well, this was a little bit of a fail after walking across all, all the way across town, but at least I got my wife some macaroons. I was on her list of gluten free things that she wanted. So uh, not perfect, but got something here. So maybe I'll try and pick up something on my way back. We will see. Well, I have not had a lot of luck and so i just picked up a few things at a market and we're gonna see what i can do all right let's see hey look at this spread you brought home well the wife is back up um i'm trying to put together some of the snacks that i found at the non-gluten-free bakeries i'm so sorry i don't know what mistake that was. Well, you got us macaroons. I didn't want to leave France without trying a macaroon. See, I told you guys she wanted a macaroon. <laughs> so cute. Okay, uh, this is the largest thing of Nutella I've ever seen. Um, is that for the apple? Yeah. They had like some, some like <laughs> French brand of Nutella and I thought about risking it, but it's, you gotta go with the classic. You gotta go with the classic. On these grapes, that looks amazing. Did you get this at the market? Yes. Thank you so much, babe. I got our podcast scheduled. Let's go. Now I'm doing a little bit of research on Florence. Our next stop, I actually have a photo of you from our honeymoon on the train to Rome. It was like nine in the morning and you were dipping cookies in a massive jar of uh. Nutella, probably about the same size. Oh my gosh. <laughs> you are a Nutella man. When I'm in Europe, I turn into a monster. <laughs> How did I do, guys? All right, this is it. It's beautiful. I'm so sorry I sent you to a non gluten free bakery. Ah, nothing a three mile walk can't fix. Oh, hey, what's your step count? I'm at 6,200. Was it worth it for the steps? Yeah, uh, yeah I'm kicking my wife's butt today. Are you kidding yeah, me? Yeah, I probably have like 10. Yeah, it's fantastic. <laughs> Thank you so much for feeding us this morning. Love you. Love you so much. Oh, Nutella. You gotta turn it off film so that you don't see how much Nutella uh, I actually eat. We're all judging the size of Nutella you put on the plate. The Nutella's for my wife. No, it's not. <laughs>
this place. Yeah, it looks Some amazing. French food. Are you going to show us your new wine skills? Get your nose buried in there. <laughs> Bury that nose. Get that's not deep enough. <laughs> All right, show us your aeration. <laughs> no, aerate it. You gotta aerate it. <laughs> Don't spit on the table. Aerate it. <laughs> Alex would be so disappointed in here. That was terrible. That was terrible. Even get after this. Oh my gosh. Look at that beauty. That is amazing. Look at those pears. Babe, it has pickles on it. And brie. Oh my goodness. Let's go. I've been waiting to eat duck in France. Here we are. Bon appetit. Bon appetit. Yeah. Oh my gosh, it's so tender. All right, I said tonight, if they have crib brulee on the menu, we gotta get it. Where is it? Boom. They put it in uh, English for us. Oh, are you is gonna break it? Tomato. Yeah. It's not a tomato. I was like crème brulee, crème brulee, whatever. <laughs> Me and the French language aren't friends. You're not friends, but. This is amazing. It's so like, it's different from any creme brulee I've ever had. How so? It's more, it's honestly a little less sweet. I don't know how to describe it other than the flavors feel more like delicate. Does that make sense? Don't ask me, ask everyone else. Does that make sense? Does my wife make sense? It's so good. The answer is no. taking care of ourselves while we're in Europe. Yeah, immunity, baby. <laughs> it's not that bad. Oh, you make it so strong. Well, I'd rather just throw it back, you know? It does not taste great after I just brush my teeth. Cheers. Go get some breakfast. Breakfast time. Breakfast time. Let's get an Alright, we've got a berry and yogurt smoothie for probiotics and antioxidants. And we got an iced coffee because we're American and we're really craving iced coffee. <laughs> and a ham and cheese omelet with a side salad because I am just craving protein and no more bread for, for a hot second. I might eat all this salad before you get any. stuck on a train because they're doing a train strike of course but now we are officially in a different country yeah richest country anywhere? yeah what the heck this, is, this place is super bougie and so we are in monaco so we're gonna go check out monte carlo yeah we are let's find it let's go find it <laughs> We are here and it is crazy. So, I wish we could see over this edge, but there's just like huge yacht central here. This is crazy though. It's very beautiful. This is 
is actually way, way more beautiful than I would have expected. We love these those cliffs in the background over yeah, there. That's really cool. It's just like straight yeah. rocks. This harbor is beautiful. Oh, bonjour. What brings you to the Monte Carlo? Bonjour. bonjour. The name is Maison. Catch me at Maison. I just want everyone to look at all of this stonework behind Molly. It looks like it's painted with all the different granites and stuff they use. It's wild. So much last night we came back it's gluten-free french food it's gluten-free it's, so hard food. To find. it's delicious cheers to our final night in france and look at, look at what we get with the bread we ordered oh tonight. my gosh look at that beautiful like, hot honey wow i can't wait like that's how i want my honey served it's so beautiful goat cheese yeah this is definitely yep. different goat cheese caramelized pears what is it almonds Gosh, this looks is this incredible. A pickle? This is a pickle. That's a pickle? Oh, no, that's, that's a, a pear. It's a pear? Yeah. <laughs> no. It's definitely a pear. Oh my gosh, lamb. First steak, baby. First steak of the trip. Let's go. So this morning we went with mango, pineapple, orange smoothie, and an iced latte instead of the blended iced latte because we figured it'd have less sugar. <laughs> yes. But they're judging us because it's like a cloudy, cool day in Nice, and we're the crazy Americans ordering iced coffee. <laughs> Sorry about it. And a ham omelet and salad. No cheese. No cheese. I feel like I'm a little cheesed out at the moment. <laughs> Cheers to our last day, our last morning in Nice, in France, and cheers to First Italia. Day to forensic. Yes.